For War number 11, season 24, uh, I'm actually going to get into the fights real quick here because uh, these go very quickly. This is the Vigorous Assault, Archer Overload, uh, Sorcerer Supreme on Path 1, Section 1. I'm going to go for uh, just some hits on the block here and uh, she's going to be so nice and throw a heavy. So, uh, that's, that's really nice of her, I guess. And yeah, this is just a rank 2. So she's going down pretty fast and I'm going to be going for heavies as much as possible. This first like three fights here in section one, they're the cleanest fights I have ever done, <laughs> in my opinion. The, the enemies barely throw any specials. I think one of them throws one special and they all just, just fall over and die. This is a rank three Mysterio on the masochism. Uh, I was a little scared that... Mysterio's immunity to ability accuracy reduction is gonna prevent my Omega from reducing his ability accuracy of shrugging debuffs. And you know, Omega Red prevents masochism by by reducing the, the debuff shrug chance, but that, that didn't work out that way. Uh, I was just fine, I was just, you know, playing like normal. No specials thrown by Mysterio, and he's dead. <laughs> I'm not even boosted that hard in this first three fights. I'm boosted harder than usual because we're going up against ASR and uh, we don't actually know how the, the war is has ended because it hasn't ended yet and it's very close and I'm not going to talk about the results and jinx anything. Alright, so this Mole Man fight, it's it's on Steady Build Up Fury. I'm a little, I'm, I have a little bit of PTSD from Steady Build Up Fury over that, uh, that Hyperion fight. But uh, we'll, we'll see how it goes. This one doesn't go that bad. So that uh, this node, uh, this node can make them hit so hard through block. It, it's kind of crazy. I got that Dijon on him right at the right time, right before he threw his SP1. His, his SP1 just does uh, create some distance between me and him. And you know, if you're a Mega Red, you don't want distance between you and any champion. All right, moving on to section two, pass three. This is the uh, the explosive personality node. I do hit him on his block a couple of times, but it's not too big of a deal. Yeah, this is the explosive personality node. This is the next morning. I'm a little bit more nervous when I'm fighting here because uh, the war is incredibly close. And I really don't want to die. I have boosted way too hard for <laughs> my two remaining fights. And I'm, I'm kind of glad I did. Um, I, I don't mess up, but I, I feel like if I maybe didn't boost as hard, I would have been more nervous, had more chances of messing up. Yeah, this fight's over uh, pretty quickly. And there's just a one final fight. Thankfully, thanks to our, uh, our overlords at, at Kabam, they have put the Power Start 1 boost back in the back in the store. So I'm using that to, to take down this Sim Supreme mini boss on the improved power gain aspect of evolution node with my magic. Uh, I, I don't, uh, based on my experience with Sorcerer Supreme, that previous war, I don't think uh, Power Start 1 or even uh, or even invulnerability is going to be necessarily useful, like necessary here, like essential here. But um, yeah, I mean, I'd just rather boost up as hard as I can and um, you know take the take the fights down without having to worry too much about you know dying. <laughs> uh, so here I also have a 200% Mystic Power boost. I have the Champion boost, and the the Sim Supreme is only only a rank two. So this way it's going to go down very very quickly in a couple of sp2s uh, again this fight's not this war is not over yet so we don't know who won or who lost we are pretty close to locking down uh, some top ranks in in the season but you know never <laughs> never count your chickens before they hatch so we're gonna see how that turns out uh, in the final war of the season i'm gonna throw the stats for wars one through ten up again because the stats for this war are obviously not up yet. And yeah, that's about it. Thanks y'all for watching. I'll catch y'all later. Bye.